Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Charles Owen, and welcome you guys to the conversation. So today we're going to be talking about is Anthony Davis the best teammate that LeBron James has ever played with? That's what I'm going to be getting into this video. Now, let me just start off this video by quickly saying no. No, he is not the best teammate that LeBron James has ever played with. But let me just make the case for Anthony Davis in case you guys don't know his stats. So Anthony Davis is a six-time All-Star, All-Star Game MVP. He's been on three All-NBA first teams. And he's been on an NBA all-defensive team and an all-second uh, defensive team. Also, he's an NCAA champion. Now, we all know that Anthony Davis is one of these generational talents. We all know this from the way he plays, from his size, his position, and all of these different things, and the numbers he's been able to put up in his career. Now, if we look at what he's averaging this season with the Los Angeles Lakers, he's averaging 21.6, 26.1 points a game. He's averaging 9.3 rebounds, getting you four assists a game. He's getting you 1.5 steals a game, and he's getting you 2.8 blocks. Going into this season, Anthony Davis said that he wanted to be the defensive player of the year. He wanted to win that award. And as you know, there's so much hoopla around the Los Angeles Lakers with the biggest and most recognizable basketball, currently active basketball player in the world, and LeBron James. And a lot of people were like, this is going to be a pairing for the ages. And looking at their record, they got up to a 17 and three starts, so they got off to a really hot start. The Lakers are doing really well. There's a buzz back in the Staples Center, and a lot of people are really excited about the Los Angeles Lakers. People like Shannon Sharp and Stephen A. Smith are like, this is the greatest teammate that LeBron has ever played with. And, you know, I think they're looking at it from a talent standpoint. Obviously, from a physicality standpoint, Anthony Davis is 6'10", weighs 253 pounds. So he's a really big boy, and he's very skilled in the low post. He can also hit the mid-range and a three-point shot. He's very good at pick-and-roll defense. So Anthony Davis is an all-world player, one of the greatest players that we've had in the league in probably the last, last 10 years, at least we're talking about from talent, from a talent standpoint and from being a big man. Now, with all of these things I just said to you, with the start that the Lakers are having, with how good that they're doing, a lot of people are going to be saying that this is the greatest player that LeBron James has, has ever played with. But for me, I beg to differ, and I say that Dwayne Wade is the best player that LeBron James has ever had the luxury of playing with because I believe LeBron James benefited greatly from playing with Dwayne Wade. So Dwayne Wade, if you guys don't know, he's a 13-time All-Star, he's a three-time NBA champion, finals MVP, even led the league in scoring uh, once in his career. If we look at his career stats, he averaged 22.2 points, uh, was it 22 points a game, 4.7 rebounds, 5.4 assists. This is because as he got older, his knees got worse. His, you know, he began to deteriorate, deteriorate from a health standpoint. So he wasn't able to perform at the level, at the all-star level that he was able to perform at when he was much younger. Early in his career, in 2006, 2007, Dwayne Wade was averaging 27 points a game. He was getting, you know, I mean, he was averaging, I think, you know, five assists, you know, four, uh, um, uh, four rebounds or so. One year, he led the league in scoring averaging 30, uh, or 30 points a game that season. He shot almost 50% from the floor. And Dwayne Wade had one of the greatest finals runs in NBA history. So why would I put Dwayne Wade ahead of Anthony Davis by a long, long, long margin? Well, it's simple. Before LeBron James went to go play with Dwayne Wade, he was already, Dwayne Wade was already a champion. Dwayne Wade has what you call winners intangibles. You cannot measure this by stats. Analytics doesn't even pick it up. But Dwayne Wade is a flat-out winner. And I don't care what anybody says. Prior to LeBron James joining Dwayne Wade, LeBron James did not know how to win. Dwayne Wade understood how to win, and he displayed that when he was playing with Shaquille O'Neal when he went against the Dallas Mavericks and beat them in the NBA Finals coming down from 2-0 to have one of the most historic NBA championship runs in the history of basketball. LeBron James benefited greatly by being around Dwayne Wade because he showed him how to win. He was also a bit older than him, so he showed him some of the ropes of the NBA. Although, I'm not saying Dwayne Wade made LeBron, because certainly LeBron played a major role in helping Dwayne Wade get those two titles. But had it not been for Dwayne Wade, I really doubt that LeBron James would have gone on to be an NBA champion. Now he's playing with Anthony Davis, and Anthony Davis, yes, is doing really well, but LeBron James is sort of, is sort of showing him the ropes. He's shielding him from a lot of criticism. Whenever the Lakers underperform, they're always looking to LeBron to say, hey, you're the reason why this team is not doing well. Whereas with Anthony Davis, 
I mean, uh, you know, Anthony Davis is not really the main focal point when it comes to media attention and all of this. Whereas Dwayne Wade was the one that, you know, was had to take a step back, hand over the keys to LeBron after a year playing in Miami when they didn't understand who the alpha or the number one option was going to be. And Dwayne Wade was able to hand it over, which is another part of being able to win by understanding when it's time to really pass over responsibilities. So in my opinion, I think Dwayne Wade is by far the greatest teammate that LeBron James has ever played with. I think if you ask LeBron this question, I think he will say it publicly that Dwayne Wade, if he's honest, that he will say it publicly that Dwayne Wade was the absolute best teammate that he, teammate that he ever played with and the proof is in the pudding. So that's what I think. But what I want to know from you guys is, do you think that Anthony Davis is the best teammate that LeBron has ever played with or do you think it's D-Wade? Whatever you think it is, please let me know what you think about it in the comment section below. Don't forget to leave a comment because I, I really want to know what you guys think about this video. Also, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. If you like the video, leave a like, hit the like button if you enjoyed it. And if you do subscribe, don't forget to hit the not notification bell to be notified when all of our newest content comes out. Once again, we want to thank you guys tremendously from Dreamers Pro and all the help you've been giving us and helping our channel grow. Really appreciate it. We're wishing you guys an amazing day. This is Charles here from Dreamers Pro. Peace.